what is the personal fat threshold? This is the body fat threshold in which once you surpass it, you begin developing many of the pathologies of insulin resistance and visceral fat accumulation, which is fat accumulation around the organs. Visceral fat is associated with a number of diseases. However, we don't know if it's the visceral fat causing the diseases or the diseases causing the visceral fat. And they've tested this hypothesis taking people who have type 2 diabetes, but actually have a fairly low body mass index. And they found that even with these people with low BMIs, losing weight did help decrease their insulin resistance and put their diabetes into remission, indicating these people simply cannot gain as much weight as other people before they begin to develop diabetes and visceral fat in all of the adverse pathologies that come along with the accumulation of visceral fat. Unfortunately, it does appear that Chinese and South Asian cohorts have the lowest personal fat threshold. Therefore, they develop visceral fat at a much lower body weight than Europeans. And Africans appear to have less visceral fat compared to Europeans. Unfortunately, there's not much we can do about this. However, it's important to understand your genetic predisposition and do your best to stay under your personal fat threshold, regardless of how low it may be.